blistering uh, start by Marina Park. Also very fast, Royal Insignia, Royal Insignia, Ovington showing very good foot too. Coming down after covering a furlong and Royal Insignia, Marina Park, College Chapel right up there in the centre too. Also showing very good speed is Watani in the centre. Watani the overall leader now in the blinkers. Watani the leader from on the far side, Catrail, Marina Park and College Chapel right over on the far side with surprise offer. On the near side, it's uh, Keen Hunter being followed by Owington. They're coming down now towards the two furlong pole and it's Watani from on the far side, Catrail. Watani and Catrail, Owington coming there on the stand side now to dispute it. It's Owington on the stand side. Catrail on the far side, between horses is so factual, but Owington has taken it up now as they race into the closing stages. It's Owington from So Factual, So Factual putting in a tremendous run on the far side. Owington and So Factual as they come to the line. Owington's going to win it. Owington's the winner, So Factual is second. And third is Catrail, four redoubtable. That's the one, two, three, four in the 1994 Corkinora Stakes with the result. First, number eight, Owington owned by Baron G. Von Ullman, trained by Jeff Ragg and ridden by Michael Hills, his second winner of the Royal Meeting, second, uh, number nine, so factual, owned by Godolphin Racing, trained by Hilal Ibrahim and ridden by Ray Cochran, third was number two, Catrail, owned by Sheikh Mohammed, trained by John Gosden, and written by Frankie de Torre, with fourth, number 14, Redoubtable. This is the winner, Owington. Brilliant performance by the winner. Always travelling well on the right with the nose band there. In the centre, Leicester had shown a lot of speed early on in College Chapel, but now dropping out four from the left. Also quick to drop out was Mutaktim, never travelling at all. At the furlong marker, Owington hits the front, and there's one challenger, so factual, the horse who went down to post early, in the blue colours now, runs a terrific race. Cat trails there in the front line, but can't find any more. Redoubtable on the far side also. But Owington, once he's got there, shows his true quality. For a second it looked as though so factual might pull him back. But Owington, Michael Hills, have things under control. A top sprinter this three-year-old, endorsing his fine performance at York. He goes on to win the Cork and Norrie today from so factual the four-year-old and the two of them are clear of last year's diadem stakes winner catrail who turned out to be the best of john gosden's three runner and that's the view that those on the heath saw as michael hills on the far side waves his whip in this good-looking green desert coat with the nose band to keep his head down winning just cosily from the four-year-old so factual, Ray Cochran riding the Dubai-trained horse. But this was Owington's day. Look at that action. A real fast ground action. A real sprinter's action. This is his trip. This is his day. Yes, a cracking performance by the Sun of Green Desert out of old Doomsday Book. 